Hello ladies and gentlemen, once again Nev from Nev's Tech Bits and today I'd like to feature this Kangaroo Drive Cloner or Hard Drive Duplicator. It's a very nice, very easy to use system. I definitely recommend this for anybody who has uh, huge amounts of drives to clone. Uh, at one of my places of work we had uh, 150 computers that we had to get up and running. At first I was doing them one at a time, but then I realized if I put a thousand dollars down on this thing, we got this one used for one thousand uh, dollars, we could take care of that. This, these days I'm pretty sure you can't even get a, a five unit dock. This is an older unit. You can get these things up to fifty units and you can just clone the night away with those things. Anyways, let me get this thing hooked up and I will show you uh, an example of how to use it. So as you can see here, I threw five drives in. The first four are going to be the ones cloned to, and the one at the far right, outlined with that white square, is the one that they're gonna clone from. So what we gotta do is hit the switch at the back. There's a giant fan on the inside of this sucker. It starts up. Kangaroo duplicator, let's go through the different settings we have. So full basically means that everything from the primary disk is going to get copied all over to the other disks. Now the important thing is if, this, so this is a 250 gigabyte drive, the others are 300, 500 gigs. This will work, we won't have any problems with this. You might have to go into disk management and extend the rest of the space in the manually if you even care, but otherwise we're good to go here, we're good to go. But if this was a 500 and these were 250, of course you wouldn't be able to do anything with that. So let's see what other options we have here. Ratio, we can we can verify all the information's good. We can erase. This thing saves me so much time. I no longer have to crush my own uh, drives by hand or with the, the iron worker. And uh, we can test the load. We can do a smart transfer. I don't know what brief is. Resize as if uh, you got something that you want to make to a smaller size. And what happens there is. Uh, is is uh, is yeah it, it does its best the best it can to resize it to a smaller size but other than that uh yeah there you go it's the kangaroo duplicator again this is an older version you can find many newer i'm pretty sure that they have uh up to up to 50 anyways let's have a look at the website for that all right so kangaroo.com slash duplicator is where you'll find these sweet duplicators kangaroo.com actually does a whole lot more than duplications they have uh, their own endpoint security protection um, secure USB drives remote management all that fun stuff but anyways what we're looking at now is the cloning devices so my device is probably about three to five years old and that one would copy up to four drives at a time it had five bays but it could do four drives the cheapest one here that will do six and the seventh one is the original so there's seven drive bays and this one is faster this one's faster than the one i got oh, let's see if i can get any more information Yep, you have most of the same options, smart mode, disk mode, brief mode, resize, ratio. This one, I believe, is five, th either five or seven thousand dollars. So I'd hate to think, I'd shudder to think what the price of uh, a 15 hard drive dock would cost. And then of course we have the 23. I thought I had seen a 50 before but I could have been wrong it could have been this one I thought it had I thought it was twice as big but you never know anyways that's all I'm seeing that's all I'm seeing of course I use something kind of like this a 3.0 copy dock but I got it from StarTech if you're really cheap if you don't have much money then just get a StarTech uh, cloning or a StarTech dock and you'll be good to go but yeah if you need if you got some industrial muscle if you're pumping out uh, image after image after image if if you have like a hundred computers that you need to copy an image onto 
this will definitely work. I prefer this to uh, putting on an image from a network because I have uh, I've always had a lot of problems with this. This is just simpler hard drive in, clone hard drive out. Very good, definitely highly recommended. Uh, and check it out. Yeah, so like and subscribe if you like this video and uh, really helps me out. And I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one.